August, I have been having a busy month of January and haven't been filming and I'm getting prepared for my birthday trip that's coming up in a couple of weeks. And so this will be kind of like a hodgepodge of different things that get ready with me. Um, some things I've just forgotten to record, you guys. I am so sorry. I am trying to do better this year because I really want to take it and start trying to focus and grow and everything. And my skin looks horrible because I fell asleep in makeup. And uh, yesterday I cleaned my house. I promise my apartment tour is coming up. Um... I have a whole thing planned for my birthday vlogs and things like that, so I plan on trying to get more content up, but I just wanted to say Happy New Year, kind of give an introduction. I know I look busted, but I'm going to record some videos, and let's get this 2019 popping, even though mine has already been popping. <laughs> See you guys later. Thanks for stopping by. I decided this morning, it is 5.20 in the morning, y'all. My skin looks horrible. Let's not talk about it. I am going through some skin changes right now. So, whatever. Um, so, I decided to do a get ready with me this morning. It's 5.20. I am actually getting ready to go to my 9 to 5. Today is MLK Day, and it is a company pay holiday. But we get double time and a half, and I like getting my Shaquin like everybody else, honey. I don't give a damn. Yes, I run my own businesses. Yes, I work a 9 to 5. I always got to have multiple strands of income. So, I am about to get ready. Um, this got off for early in the morning. Because I'm going to go make this double time and a half for... Four hours of my time, which would be double time and a half plus eight hours of holiday pay. So, I'm about that life right now. And I'm so excited because I just looked at my calendar and I have like 15 days till Vegas. To my birthday trip, I'm so freaking happy and excited. So freaking happy and excited about that. So I got that coming up too. Turn up is getting ready to be real. For sure. Viva Las Vegas, baby. I can't wait. Y'all, I'm doing my makeup. <laughs> so jacked up right now. I am literally, <laughs> y'all is getting the like, I'm in a rush. I'm trying to hurry. Because it's like 520. I have to be there at 7. I work 15 minutes away from my house. But, Here's the thing. I've been up since 2.51 this morning because my insomnia decided to kick in full force for some reason. And I've been up watching YouTube. <laughs> then, too, I really, since I have, you guys, so right now I'm starting my second week. Of my induction phase for Atkins. And anybody that has done the two weeks. The first two weeks of Atkins. Would know that like. It is a sacrifice. 
because you're trying to jumpstart your weight loss. And it's a freaking sacrifice because you can only eat 20 grams of carbs a day. And some people be like, well, how can you survive and eat? It is designed to get your body detoxed from sugars and um, carbs, bad carbs, and put your body into ketosis to maximize your jumpstart of your weight loss. And so I'm in my second week. I can already tell like in my face and stuff uh, this is finally trying to go up thank god <laughs> but um yeah so i'm starting to tell in my face and stuff that um you know the process is working i can tell in my clothes and everything as well I found this damn I pencil and this ain't the move today <laughs> I don't have time I'll use my smoking mirrors one but yeah so and I'm in Indianapolis, you guys, and we had a so-called snowstorm for the second weekend in a row. This time, it didn't get as much snow as it did last time, but it's freaking ice outside, and I'm going to have to go warm up my car soon um, before I leave to go to work. And it's just a mess. It's a mess outside right now. Well, I live right by the highway, so, like, I can hear, like, if people are, like, struggling on the highway. And let me tell you something. These folks have been zooming. So, I think I'm going to use my Color Story Metallic Nudes palette today. I got this from Five Below. I don't want it to blind you guys. But I got it from Five Below. It was four dollars. I actually like it. Um, it's a pretty good palette uh, for the nudes that I like. Um, you know, kind of nude colors. This one actually was cracked, so I didn't hit pink yet. <laughs> it just looks busted <laughs> from just kind of tossing it and stuff like that so just uh kind of ignore that one and i need to clean my makeup brushes it's terrible like i don't even know where my damn <laughs> makeup wipes are right now and i'm wearing all black today Which is the color professional attire for hairstylists, which we all know that I do that as well. I have a some unboxings to do. I'm so behind you guys because I've actually been busy. Um, since January 1. Uh, well, really since the end of December. I've been busy. And that's because, you know, I don't want to speak on nothing too soon, but I've been occupied dating and everything. So, yeah. I've been keeping busy <laughs> amongst other things. <laughs> so.
So yeah, that's what I've been doing. Um, and of course, trying to plan for this trip. It's just trying to get everything coordinated, trying to verify how many people are actually going. And it looks like it's just going to be, I invited my closest folks, but you know, I've noticed that because you fuck with somebody heavy and I don't wanna get flagged cause I be cussing. I be trying not to. Um, but I'ma just give you the tea, the realness. Like I have really discovered that just cause you mess with somebody a certain type of way and you mess with them heavy, it doesn't mean that they do. It doesn't mean that they mess with you like you mess with them. Y'all see how this color is, though? I got a ring light, too, y'all. This is gonna make my quality better. So, like, I'm just building up the different bronzes and stuff like that. Because that's just my zhuzh. I love pretty golds and browns and... stuff like that and when you wear all black you can really play around play around with the colors So the, I'm using this darkish, like brownish green, black color right there. And I am using this knickknack palette that I got from my local indie beauty supply store. If you're in Indiana, look them up. I go there all the time. Even if you're not licensed, you can set up an account and earn money off coupons so it's really kind of a good deal um if you're in the indianapolis area and looking for a beauty supply store um you know and then at least every time you come back to visit you can always go and earn money while you shop now with me being a licensed professional I can uh yeah this is what you get at five o'clock in the morning makeup <laughs> like I'm, I'm still half sleep now I'm gonna take my blending brush and kind of blend everything together And I have like four different colors on. So my base color, my base color I used is the one that's kind of like the pink. And then my transition color was this. My inner crease color was this. So those are the colors that I mix together to get this coppery look. And I still look a mess because I have my highlighter, my concealer on, and that's because I'm kind of covering my blemishes and that's what I usually do. It depends on what kind of look I'm going for. Um, 
as far as how I put on my makeup and this is just an everyday look so I'm kind of everywhere with it don't pay me no mind my favorite 355 Maybelline Fit Me Foundation Matte and Poreless Yes, this is my favorite one, 355 Coconut. I go through like a ton of this crap. I go through like this makeup a lot. Um... Because I like the way it matches me. Or whatever. I'm going to bust out my Clinique Mini. Mascara. Because I'm not putting any lashes on today. y'all and also like I have stairs at my job so last week because I've been doing the Atkins and whatnot I started incorporating my exercise and taking the stairs and because they moved us from where we were at um instead of going up four flights of steps two days um two twice a day because I'm building myself up. Um, I start, uh, we moved up to the fourth floor, which is six flights of stairs twice a day. And it's been kicking my butt besides, I get bored freaking when I exercise I have to change up my routines because if I don't I get so bored and then I'll be over it and I'm trying to make this a permanent lifestyle change instead of keep yo-yoing back and forth I'm trying to make it a permanent lifestyle change and it's hard um sometimes because like with me starting the six flights of steps you guys like honestly I wind up getting sick because I felt like I pushed myself so hard um Friday that my body had a reaction to it <laughs> like what are you doing girl and then this weekend I've been chilling because it's been snowing and icing thought I seen something on my ceiling but apparently I am tripping yeah anyway I'm just rambling this morning I really just wanted to do a get ready with me <laughs> a quick simple makeup look and yeah my hair is busted y'all this week I'm so spoiled now with human hair going back to synthetic or blends are kind of annoying because I'm like I'm over it now like I just like human hair but sometimes sometimes this is my next 
Dilly Finish Finishing Spray. Um, I forgot about that. <laughs> you know how you put stuff away and you be like, I'm not wearing this for a reason. <laughs> and I just realized why the hell I put this <laughs> black shirt up that I had <laughs> that I have been kind of and you know what y'all I got this in a little ratchet ass ponytail this week right but let me tell you something I am about to be at work right and it's a holiday nobody's really gonna be there and I just want to look somewhat presentable but to be honest with you, I mean, this is probably the best I'm going to do today, y'all. Like, charge it to my head, not my heart. I'm not trying to look five-star like I normally do. But if I could look a little bit like I normally do, then that's fine. I don't want to look like I just got up out the bed. <laughs> That was really <laughs> my main um and my lips are so freaking dry. I don't know, I'm putting no lipstick on. And all my lip glosses are in my purse. <laughs> this cutie is still being sported, y'all. I done got so many compliments on it. I love it. It's like a statement piece for me. So, I've been wanting... I feel like I don't have voluptuous lips like that. So, I've been using this NYX Pump It Up because... I don't know. I feel like I don't have normal black people lips. Like... <laughs> I don't have them juice coasters <laughs> at the top. I think my bottom lip <laughs> is fine. It's this top lip that I feel like, you know, I feel like I should be able to get that perfect. That perfect palette. But it just don't work that way. So you guys, okay, so you see my messy closet in the back. I did some organizing, but it just seems like it's not working. I did do some major organizing though, but in my room. But this is the final look. Y'all don't call me out. It's early as hell here. And I know my lace is not melted none of that like this is just every day but look at that look at that look though y'all see how I blended those eyeshadows together it looks freaking good Like, you would not think the mess that I started off as would look this cute. But it's possible. It is possible. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this little chit-chat. Get ready with me. Thank you all for stopping by. Always remember to stay fabulous, stay positive, and stay glam.